So this is the other plant what I was saying about sorrel or plantain. Apparently these plants are good for health reasons. Okay, everything is good for health reasons. But this is probably the main purpose is not really just eating, making tea and different things. So slightly bigger corn, barely gonna make it this year, I suspect. Like as soon as it gets cold, everything stops growing. It's a tomato. That's a cabbage from last year. Not looking great, but never mind. That one is one from last year also. That's some mint over here, which I like them. And this is plantain again. They would have been much taller, but the previous bunnies ate them. That's before I put the fence up. Mint is quite good. If the soil is good, they will spread quickly on the ground. And that's the bay leaf tree. That's quite big. I cut it the other day. And I got some more stuff here. Spinach is a tall one. That's a tomato tree down there. It's a corn, slightly bigger. This one over here is slightly bigger. Again, that's the spinach or the um, plantain. That's another leafy green I planted this year. One of them in the pots. This one, another one, leafy green, but <clears throat> the insects or the birds or something love this one a lot. They keep eating all of them. And I'm moving this, the, like I said, the planting of the spinach, not spinach, planting of the um, sorrel trees. I'm spreading them out. And this is some artichokes. This, if you like artichokes, easiest plant to grow. They don't do anything. They're very strong, very resilient, very aggressive. Uh, your whole garden will be overrun if you don't keep them under control. That's a fruit tree. I've just pruned it. Like some sort of plum. It's only born fruits once, but they're not bad actually. These, I think, are carrots, for, for sure. These ones, I think, are also. But again, uh, I had lots of seeds, and I just didn't label them. Oops, the bunny's trying to go into my... I need to lock it. Go into the greenhouse. They just got this bunny like two days ago, three days ago, and it's very comfortable now. So let me just lock this one. Everything will be eaten. I'm planning on cutting the yard today, but. So it's the sun comes out. The previous bunnies were smaller. So this fence was high enough for them. But this one is a bigger bunny, which I suspect if he tried, he could jump over the fence. Or oh, the chicken wire, I should say. That is some sort of thing, Japanese. Okay, one second. It's everywhere. There you go. It's everywhere running around me. That's actually not his house. That was the house with the previous bunnies. So I got eaten. Something broken at the side and ate them. 
So this one they keep inside. Bunny is nothing to do with me because for me I wouldn't get them. But they're cool. And these are the seeds it's here. So in this year I'm gonna get like a million of these seeds. So I let them overgrow so to get the seeds and then they'll have to buy again, right? So this one is gonna produce like tons and tons of seeds. And this, like I said, they they love to eat them. Can't stop.